Hello friends, today we will be doing Math Kangaroo Level 1 and 2 Year 2021, the four pointer questions. In the earlier video, we did the three pointer questions and there will be one more video wherein we would be doing the five point questions. So four point questions start from question number nine until question number 16. So the three pointers start from question one to eight, the four pointers nine to 16 and the five pointers go from 17 to 24. So let's start with uh, question number nine. Rose the cat walks along the wall. She starts at point B and follows the direction of the arrow shown in the picture. The cat walks a total of 20 meters. Where does she end up? So she walks, so she starts at point B. So she starts from here. So she walks to C. So it's four plus one, five. Five plus five, 10 plus 2, 17, plus 3, 20. Uh, uh, 5 plus 10, so this is 15. So it reaches B at 15. Then again, 4, uh, which is uh, 19 plus 1, 20. So it will reach point D. Whenever we are doing these questions, just look for numbers that make up 5 or 10. So if you do 4 plus 1, 5, 5 plus 5 is 10 and do 2 plus 3, which is another 5. So you get a 15 instead of going 4 plus 1, 5, plus 5, 10, plus 2, 12, 13. So you'll go wrong with that. Just try to make up 5 or multiples of 10. So for question number 9, my answer is option D. Question number 12, uh, question number 10. Edmund cut a ribbon as shown in the picture. How many pieces of the ribbon did he finish with? So he's cutting this piece of ribbon. So how many pieces will he get? So let's just count. So this piece, like it's cut from here. So this whole piece is one. Then you have a two. Then you go like this. This one is three. Then you go like this. This one is four. Then this one is five. This whole thing is six. This one is seven. Similarly, this one is 8, this one is 9, you have a 10, this one is 11, and this one is 12. So my answer for this is option D, 12. Question number 11. Julia has two pots with flowers as shown. She keeps the flowers exactly where they are. She buys more flowers so that each pot will have the same number of each type of flower. Okay, oh, so that means, see, this one has how many flowers? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And this one has one, two, three, four, five, six. So they have the same number of flowers, but they don't have the same type of flowers. So what is the smallest number of flowers she needs to buy? Now let's just start with these white. So you have two of these, here you have four. So you need to buy two more of these flowers. Then here you have these gray four flowers. Here you just have one. So you need to buy three more of these flowers. And here you have two of these. And here you have three. So that means you need to buy one more for this one. So you have to buy a total of six flowers, which is option C. So if that happens, then both the pots will have equal number as well as equal type of Flower. Question number 12. Tom encodes the word using the board shown. For example, the word pizza has the code A2, A4. Like what does this mean? P is here. So this one is A2, like that. Then I is here, so which is A4. Then Z is C1. And again, C1 and A is D2. That's the coding that they're doing. So what word did Tom encode as B2, B3? So let's just say B3, B2, C4, and D2. So B is here and 3 is here. So this one is M, then B2. So that one is an A, then C4, which is T, and D2, which is H. So the word is math. So my answer is option E. Question number 13. 
question number 13 which figure can be made of these two pieces so i have two of these pieces which figure can be made from it so whenever we have these visual questions always start with a method of elimination now suppose we check for a okay now let's start with the this so you have a circle and you have two of these so suppose this is we have a circle here so it will be like this so we have a circle two diamonds then again a circle plus this plus then a circle then again you have a diamond and a plus so this piece is actually being rotated and then you have a plus and a diamond and again a plus a circle plus diamond plus in a circle and two pluses so my answer is a we have got it there was no the since my option a is the answer there was not method of elimination but we can also look for other options suppose if we check for b so if i check for b i'll look at this uh you know I have a circle and two diamonds. Now, if you look for B, you don't have two diamonds together anywhere, right? So, or it's here, you have, but you don't have it beneath the, uh, here also you don't have, you don't have a circle and two diamonds together. So, it is not B, okay? If suppose we see C, you have a circle, two diamonds, then another circle, this, this. So, this piece is here. But when we look at this piece, you have a circle, a plus, then again a diamond. You don't have two plus here like this. So C is not my answer. So similarly, if you look for options, D and E will also be not my answer. The answer would be option A. Question number 14. Julie and Angela played Kang Ball, a ball game. Kang Ball is just a fictitious game because it is math kangaroo. So they've put Kang Ball. Otherwise, you don't have such kind of a game. A ball game. Each goal in the game scores two points. Julie scored five goals and Angela scored nine goals. How many more points than Julie did Angela score? So how many goals did Angela score extra? Which was four goals. A lot of kids, what they do is they just mark the answer as four. So they're not talking about goals. They're talking about points. And each goal has two points. So how many more points does Angela have? Angela has eight more points. So my answer is option C. Okay, don't be in a hurry to mark option A. Read the question and then mark accordingly. So option C is the answer for 14. Now for question number 15. The picture shows the five houses of five friends and their school. So this is the school and these are the five houses. The school is the largest building in the picture. To go to school, Doris and Ali walk past Leo's house Eva walks past Chloe's house, which is Eva's house. Now, if you see, or uh, in this case, there's a house here. So the person who is living in this house will have to walk past this house to go to school. So in what is the options that I have? They are saying Eva walks past Chloe's house. So this has to be Eva's house and this has to be Chloe's house. So Eva is staying here. So she walks past Chloe's house to go to the school. And Doris and Ali walk past Leo's house. So this has to be Doris' house and this has to be Ali's house or the other way around, Ali or Doris. They have to walk past Leo's house to go to the school. So the question is, which is Eva's house? So the Eva's house is option B. Question number 16. The kangaroo had two branches for lunch. Each branch had 10 leaves. The kangaroo ate some leaves from one branch. Then from the second branch, it ate as many leaves as were left on the first branch. How many leaves in total were left on the two branches? So what are they saying? There is branch one and there is branch two. The kangaroo ate some leaves and there were some leaves which were left and total. So on branch one, there were 10 leaves and on branch two also there were 10 leaves. So the kangaroo ate some leaves from the first branch. Now we don't know how many did they eat. You can take any number. For example, we just take number one. Okay. So he ate one and nine were left on branch one. 
Okay, then from the second branch, it ate as many leaves as were left on the first branch. So how many were left on the first branch? Nine. Okay, so he ate nine. So how much is left on branch two? One. So how many leaves in total were left? How many leaves in total were left? Nine plus one is ten. Uh, how many leaves in total were left on the two branches? It is option D. You can do this with any number. For example, you can do the same thing. Let me just erase it. Now, if suppose you can take any number. I did it with a 1. You can take, say, 4. Suppose he ate 4. So, how many are left? 6. So, from branch 2, he ate 6. So, how many are left? 4. So, whichever combination you take, you'll always get 10 leaves which were left. I hope you liked my video. Do check out my other videos, the three pointers and the four pointers for this paper. Do subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.